morning everybody just waking up I've got to go to a meeting this morning thank you for watching yesterday's vlog if you got to watch it we are currently back in action and we are vlogging on the ADD now sorry for the lighting here it's a little off I've got to pack up and get ready to head to my meeting for nine o'clock I'm gonna be running a little late if I don't get going right now so I will catch up with you guys later oh and by the way oh and by the way it is snowing out again for the hundredth time I mean don't get me wrong we live in Maine and I don't mind the fact that it snows but really take a look at this just take a look I mean really like it's not snowing at the moment but it did snow that's what I'm trying to say Man, is it annoying. But it is what it is, I guess. Man, I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. I gotta pack up and get ready to go to my meeting. So I'll catch up with you guys later. Alright, talk to you later. Mm, bye. Man, guys, it snowed out for sure. Take a look. My windshield wiper. My windshield. Look at it. I mean, gee. It's no. You could definitely tell for sure. Well, hey, we're getting ready to head to my meeting right now, so I will catch up with you guys in a few. All right. I am going to clean off my car, get everything set up, and we will. Head on over to my meeting. I'll catch up with you in a little bit. All right, bye. Hey guys, so I just had to make a quick run to Walmart and pick up a couple things. And now we're going to go and try to get some other things taken care of. We're going to head down to Portland and try to get some bills paid. And we're going to see what we can do. Uh, this lighting is crappy, but mind the lighting. We're going to see what we can do today and try to get some stuff done. I have to be at work at 3 to 11 tonight. So I'm going to go up to Portland and get a few things down there. Um, supplies, camera gear, stuff trade some of my gear in and get some more stuff hoping if I can do it correctly we won't have to spend anything any money at all but I'm gonna try to go down to Portland and try to get some stuff it'll be about an hour 45 minute drive give or take so I will catch up with you guys a little bit later all right talk to you later bye We just went over to my local camera store and they didn't have the uh, 10 to 18 in stock. They had a 10 to 18 and a 50 millimeter in what's called a crater kit from Canon. But I come to find that I'm really not using my 50 as much as I used to. I mean, STM 50 is good, but I'm not a big fan of the, the 50 millimeter, to be honest with you. We're going to go over to uh, Best Buy around the corner and try to see if we can find uh, one over there. They might have it in stock there. If they don't, then I'll probably order it at my local camera store around the corner. So let's go over there and check out and see if they have anything over there. And if they have anything at Best Buy locally, then we'll go check them out and grab it there. But if they don't, then I'll keep it at his. Alright, we'll catch you guys in a little bit. Give you an update. Hey guys, we're back. We just got done at Best Buy, and yes, they had the lens I was looking for, the 10 to 18 millimeter. You ready? This is what it looks like at 18 millimeter. Now, this is what your normal kit lens would look like, 
at its full. I have the 18 to 55 millimeter non IS STM lens. That's what uh, I was using before, and that was loud as all days. Now we've got the 10 to 18. This is at 18 with a platinum UV variable ND filter. Check this one out. Ready? There we go. That's pretty sweet. It's pretty wide. I love that. That's cool. All right. We're checking it out. So enjoy. This is 10 millimeters, which we're going to be running for a while. I'm going to fix the exposure because for whatever reason, the exposure is kind of uh, odd right now. It a little dark. So give me one second here. A little dark. Let me get this back up to speed here. Ah, oh, that is so much better. Yeah, that's so much better right there. I feel like that's a little more, little, little better exposed. Whether it's overexposed or not, that's still better exposed. And I think that looks a lot better. So we're gonna be rocking the 10 to 18 millimeter for a while and see how we like that. So hopefully you guys like and enjoy. We are gonna go do some vlogging and see what's going on. I am currently waiting for my friends to get here. Depending on what time they decide to show up, I am going to, depending on what time they decide to show up, will depict on what time things happen. So I'm gonna play around this lens for a little bit and see what I can make of this lens. And I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. All right? Hey guys, so we just got done at uh, Friendly's near the mall and then we left the girls they went to uh the mall to go do some shopping or whatever they're going to do and i just getting ready to go to work i have to be there for three i'm going to be heading up there now i just stopped to get gas and then i'm going to head over there to work i will catch you guys a little bit when i get to work and get you updated on what's going on at work all right talk to you guys later bye just arrived at work, gonna head in and go get ready for my day. I will catch up with you guys when I get inside and let you know what's going on. So, see you in a second. As you guys can see, I'm currently at work. I'm now trying out the Dead Cat Wind Muff. I'm here just chilling, finishing up my night. I'm gonna give you my recap on the day. I basically, today I woke up, I had a meeting with my case manager. If you don't know, I have a case manager. Um, I'm autistic. I have been since I was 16. I support autism. If you do too, leave a link in the comments down below who, which person or who you know that's autistic. Me, my sister, both my sisters actually are autistic. I th I'm pretty sure my oldest sister has dyslexia and my younger sister has ADHD. And I have uh, Asperger's. It's not classified as that anymore, but I do have Asperger's. It's autistic. Um, to recap a little bit, I went and did a case, saw my case manager. We did some stuff there. And then I went to my I went to Walmart to get a few things. And then I went to Portland to pick up a few pieces of camera gear the lens I'm using right now and I went and hung out with some friends unexpectedly I uh, got a message from a friend and she wanted to meet up and so we met up and did that so we did that it was pretty cool we went to friendlies for lunch I didn't have a lot of money but we went to friendlies for lunch and got some food and then I came here to work afterwards it's pretty cool I had fun all in all, today was pretty pretty uneventful. Not too much going on. But we are going to be bringing you more vlogs as we go through the day. I love doing this. I have fun doing this. I, I mean, I don't really feel like I have too much to offer the world as, like, vlogging style-wise. I just think it's cool to talk to the camera and get my thoughts out. And anyone who watches, cool on you. If you don't, cool on you too. But I'm just going to vlog and keep you guys updated and tell you what's going on. I'm still learning the ins and outs of my ADD with the dual pixel autofocus man is that dope I mean I say that word a lot but you are on the dope squad come down here and meet me but yeah I was gonna give you the update on how it works going it's been pretty quiet here if you don't know I work at a CM Brown oil company 
here in Maine and I just sit in an office basically and I manage customers and I help customers with gas and stuff like that I'm basically a gas attendant and I just run a register and stuff like that and I help with pumps and just random stuff around nothing too fun or hard most days I'm just sitting in the office watching YouTube or watching videos or things like that and when people need help I just help them out and the occasional customer walks by and I have to hoot and holler at them for having company trucking cards EFS and com data and things like that for all you who are truckers and know that but anyways yeah so just one thing I want to give you a word of advice for today um, I've, I've been watching this youtuber known as Evan Shanks M many of you may know him shout out to Evan Shanks he's a really cool guy of mine he does this really cool thing that I think is awesome I'm gonna start trying to implement it in my in my daily vlogs to give you kind of a word of advice of what some advice um, I'm a Christian I'm a Christian gentleman as you all might know I go to church I believe in God I believe in the Bible some of you may have different thoughts and preference on it but this is my beliefs take it or leave it as it is this is about me and my vlog if you watch that's cool if you believe that's cool leave it in the link below or down below what you think but as of right now my word of advice for you today is stay true to yourself and believe and never give up no matter how hard it is and when a door shuts don't ever give up just keep pressing on and push forward if the door closes, it just means that that one part of your life is done. And there's something else that's coming next. I used to hate when the doors would close. I would get really annoyed and mad. But, and I had even, because being autistic, I would have a hard time with that. But I encourage you to just keep going, keep pressing on, don't give up. If you have a dream, Go for it. Don't ever give up. Keep dreaming. And if one door gets shut or someone tries to stop you, that's, to me, just a sign that it's meant to be. The harder it is, the better it's going to be on the other side. Just keep that in mind. So stay true to yourself and never give up. That's my word of advice today. So dope squad, stay dope. And have a great day. Peace.